Another Bring TV exclusive. Exclusive. I'm on uppers, I'm on downers, I don't know where I want to go. I've been drinking. Young Tay. Memphis, Tennessee. Born and raised Westwood. Go to Trick. I started rapping at the age of seven. I guess you could say I've been pretty much doing it seriously since 15, so about 10 years now. Uh, I actually grew up in a gospel family, uh, so pretty much my entire family we had a, a gospel workshop called uh, Chambers Total Gospel Center in South Memphis, and so I pretty much grew up around music. I grew up actually born in the record store, so everybody. Anybody that does music actually inspired me. Mm -hmm. Most definitely, you can check out my single PlayStation as heard on BT 106 and Park uh, on my music channel at youtube.com slash young taz music. Uh, another single hit video, you can check out the Go Remix uh, featuring my guy Honey Watts and my homeboy Riddy. Shout out to them. Uh, that's available on YouTube as well as my Reverb, uh, ReverbNation.com. Slash Young Tad Music. Uh, currently got my second mixtape uh, in progress. Uh, Listen to Die Volume 2. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Hoping to release that real soon. Uh, just pretty much getting the artwork and everything put together. But that's going to be a, a, a very nice release coming up. Uh, honestly, I love to collab with any and everybody. I don't, I don't really say no to anybody. Uh, somebody that I could definitely say I want to collab with very soon. Uh, Miss Kia Johnson. Uh, definitely want to work with her. Uh, Chris O. Chris Thomas. Um, a lot of people. I mean, pretty much is doing hip hop. Anybody that's doing music, I mean, you can holler at me. I'm, I'm ready. I honestly believe what sets me apart from a lot of artists in Memphis is I'm uh, more animated with my music. Uh, I, I try to be as diverse as possible, taking any and every open lane, and uh, really just trying to bring back the storytelling, uh, a lot of comedy within music, and just entertain people, you know, have fun with it. Uh, right now, uh, working on this project, I'm working with Joe Blow, the CEO. Uh, JP, uh, K97X, big thing, JP on the tracks, uh, producing a lot of tracks on there. Uh, my homeboy, Kevin, Sleepy Plunkett, uh, Sleepy the producer, been working with him on a lot of stuff, so, uh, Garrett Jordan, uh, who produced the PlayStation track, uh, anybody that's really open and, and ready to work, I've been basically collabing and doing as much as I can with him. Uh, spare time. <laughs> I guess you could say workout. Uh, I'm also a personal trainer at the French Riviera Spa. Uh, sports, anything athletic, anything that's a challenge, I'm, I'm up in it. Uh, 106 in Park was really an experience for me. Uh, gave me a chance to kind of get to know, it gave me a chance to network, get to know a lot of people behind the scenes of, of BET, uh, know how it operates. Uh, both times that I went, I was able to meet a lot of celebrities that were there. David Banner was there the first time I went. Usher was there. Uh, Master P uh, actually sat down, talked with me uh, a lot about the industry, a lot about music, and you know, kind of the route that he took and the route that he's taking now. And uh, they pretty much gave me a lot of inspiring words. And it, it was really an eye opener for me. And it honestly kind of opened up the floodgates in regards to my music. It, it gave me the exposure that I needed to a lot of people that I necessarily wouldn't have been able to reach before uh, on a national level. Uh, I mean, since then, our Facebook <laughs> friends went up, YouTube views went up, so uh, that, that pretty much got me, I guess, the boost that I honestly needed to get me where I am now and uh, go further. I'm actually excited about the current state of Memphis music. I feel that a lot of, I guess, the the conflict that we had, a lot of the, the segregation that we had as artists is kind of dying down with the whole Team Memphis music and uh, the Team Memphis movement that we're working towards. So uh, I'm, I'm actually excited about all the collaborations that I'm seeing, all the, the Team Memphis cyclists. You can definitely check that out. Shout out to my guy KL for that one. And uh, I mean, it's, it's, we're in a really good state right now. The, the older generation, you know, salute to them for kind of paving the way 
but now the new generation is kind of rising up and, and, and coming together, which is something that hasn't really been seen uh, in a long time for Memphis music. So I'm, I'm very excited about what you're doing. My advice for anybody that's uh, pretty much aspiring to be an uh, artist would be do it. I mean, don't take no for an answer, or if you hear no, ask why. And kind of learn from that what you can do to, to make yourself better, work hard at your craft, study it, learn the business, uh, learn behind the scenes. I mean, know it, know it, own it, accept what you do to live. Next up for me is the sky's the limit. And I don't see the sky as just clouds and, and blue is beyond it. Uh, so I'm just really trying to tackle everything that I can uh, and, and progress. Uh, you can check me out at facebook.com slash youngtaz901. That's Y-U-N-G-T-A-Z 901. Uh, Twitter, Young Taz 901, spell the same. Reverb, Young Taz Music. Uh, YouTube.com, Young Taz Music. And you can check out my website, www.youngtaz.com. Uh, thank y'all so much for the support. All my fans, I appreciate the love. I love y'all back. And I'm doing it for you. And now back to more Brink TV. You are watching Brink TV. Young Brink. Young Brink. Young Brink.